Hey, this is Nate Mill. This is the version 2 of my how to install Android Market on a rooted Kindle Fire video. Um, this method is much more streamlined and is available for people outside the US because we will not be using anything from the Amazon App Store. So the first step is to click in the notification bar, select more, go down to device, and change allow installation of applications from unknown sources to on just like that you can go home next we're going to go to the web click the URL bar and type in bit dot ly forward slash kindle root Explorer. One word, and that will be in the video description also if you didn't catch that. You then will click on this download now button. Then click slow download. Wait 20 seconds. Okay, when that's finished, click download file now. Okay, then in your notification bar, go ahead and click up here by your name. And you should see it downloading. When it's finished downloading and says download complete, go ahead and select it. It'll ask you if you want to install it click install in the lower left and then done alright now go back to the URL bar type in bit dot ly forward slash kindle market one word again that will take you here to multi upload Click on this direct download link. And you can click home from this point. You can see it downloading up there again. Alright, when that's finished, press home. And let's launch Root Explorer. Go ahead and allow the super user request. Alright, now we're going to navigate to SD card, download, and you'll see that Kindle Fire Android Market .zip we just downloaded. Go ahead and long press it, extract all, and then you can hit go to extracted to take us to the extracted folder. Select Kindle Fire Android Market again. Okay, we have three apps in there. First thing we're going to do is click on Google Services Framework. Select Install. Select Install again. Then press Done. Market.apk, long press it. Select Move. Then we're going to hit back, back again, back again, back again. Okay, right there until you see system. Select that. Select app. And then up here at the top, you should see a button that says mount r slash w. Click on that. Now the button should say mount r o just leave it like that. Then down here in the lower left click paste so now if you look you have market.apk in that list we're going to long press on that again 
select permissions and in the video description I'll have an image that shows you what permissions to set the first row the first two boxes are checked the next two rows the only the first box is checked so this one this one and that one and that one again I'll have a diagram in the video description I know you can't see it in the video here so select OK then we're going to select market.apk just press it quickly don't long press select install hit OK and install select done now we need to reboot the Kindle Fire once rebooted we're going to launch Root Explorer navigate to SD card then extracted Kindle Fire Android Market and select marketopener.apk select install and install again and done and we'll go home you should then see the market icon here in your uh, recently used apps or in your app drawer here. Select that and your market should open asking you to add an account. So let me do that and I'll be right back. After I finished entering my account information it's been loading for quite a while so I'm gonna hit back and try to launch it again and it should open right up. So there we go there's the market. Let me download World of Goo here. Make sure it works. Yep, looks like it's working fine.